Over the last decade, I've had this meme sent to me at least a hundred times. A well-tailored suit is to women what lingerie is to men. Now with this meme is usually either a question or a statement. If it's a question, it's usually Antonio, is this true? If it's a statement, they're usually simply saying Antonio, this is so true. The moral of the story, women love a well-fitted suit on the man. And gents, it don't matter if you're big, skinny, short, if the suit complements your body build, it's going to make you look better. And simply put, gents, that's what the ladies love. A man that's putting his best foot forward, that's trying, that's putting in the effort. In today's video, gents, things that you can wear that get you noticed by the ladies, items that make you irresistible. Now, this next one may be a little bit controversial and I want to hear from you down in the comments. Do you agree or disagree? But I'm going to say a wedding ring makes a lot of guys irresistible. Now, I'm a happily married man but I'm not dead. And I notice that a lot of ladies are very friendly to a guy that's wearing a wedding ring. Maybe it's because it makes them feel more at ease. Maybe it's because I'm more confident than I was when I first got married. Or maybe it's because women want something that they can't get. Whatever the reason, Jets, understand that when you make this commitment, it's one of those cruel life twists. Somehow you become more attractive and it seems like more women are throwing themselves at you. Next up on the list, sports jackets and leather jackets. Now, jackets in general do a lot for a man's physique. They build up the shoulders and they can slim up the waistline, especially when you stand and you zip the jacket up a bit or you butt in the case of a sports jacket. Jackets make you look taller by building up the shoulders and they isolate and draw attention to the hands. Hands women find very attractive on most men, especially if you've got a little bit of calluses if you work with your hands. In addition, leather jackets have a unique advantage in that they're made from leather. Leather is viewed as one of the most masculine and manly fabrics out there. Seriously, they did this study, laid out all these fabrics and they asked women to rate each of the fabrics, what properties it gave off. Leather, again and again, masculine, strong, animalistic. This is something that women were drawn to and when you wear this, it gives off that vibe. Now, gents, let's change gears and talk about something that women don't find attractive and that's a guy that doesn't take care of himself. Now, guys, did you know that 52% of men over the age 40 are at some point going to deal with erectile dysfunction? And the worst part is that 75% of those guys, three out of four, will not seek treatment. Gents, that's why I'm proud to bring you Roman, the sponsor of today's video because they've made it easy to chat with a doctor online. Gents, my friends over at Roman have spent years building a digital platform that can connect you with a doctor licensed in your state all from the comfort of your home. Everything can be handled online in a convenient, discreet manner. Gents, getting started is simple. Just grab your phone or computer, go to GetRoman.com slash ArmorUs, complete a free online visit, and you'll hear back from a U.S. licensed physician within 24 hours. If your doctor decides that treatment would be appropriate, they can prescribe genuine medication that can be delivered in discreet packaging right to your door with free two-day shipping. You also get free unlimited follow-ups with your doctor anytime you have questions. So if you're struggling with ED, stay home and go to getroman.com slash armors for a free online visit and free two-day shipping. Again, that's getroman.com slash armors for a free online visit and free two-day shipping. Next up on the list, your signature scent. Now, when I say signature scent, this is a fragrance that you've worn, that you feel confident wearing, you've gotten compliments, you know that this works good for your own body chemistry. And here's the thing, is that men can naturally detect this. If you've got a scent that somebody gave to you but you don't really like it, that's not your signature scent. Instead, go try a few different ones. Find something that you absolutely love and wear it. That will become your signature scent. Now, once you identify your signature scent, you want to practice wearing it because some fragrances you can wear a few sprays, other ones you probably only want to wear one because they're powerful. If you wear five sprays of this, you're going to blow people out of the room. You're going to suffocate them. That being said, there are some fragrances that don't project that much. You can wear a few sprays, especially close to the body, and they're not going to project that much and you're going to be smelling good most of the day. And don't be afraid to experiment. Go find something off the beaten path. Maybe you like Paco Rabanne Invictus. Well, why not try one of the flankers? I love Aqua. Or maybe everyone talks about Creed Aventus. Well, have you tried Original Vetiver? An amazing fragrance. And just remember, for this to work, for you to get noticed, for you to get compliments from the ladies, you've got to wear the fragrance. Don't let that fragrance wear you. What I mean by this is you've got to practice. You've got to know. You've got to feel confident. You've got to feel good when you put this stuff on. Because if you're going to wear something like Eau Sauvage, 
extreme. This is a great fragrance, but you got to have cojones. You got to know what you're doing when you wear this classic right here, but you will get compliments. Some people may not like it, but it doesn't matter. You're wearing it for yourself and that's what the ladies are going to pick up on. Next up, let's talk about shades. So, shades do two things. One, they create mystery because people can't see the eyes. Women, they love a man of mystery. Next up, it creates symmetry. So, symmetry, this is basically where both sides of our face look the same, but here's the thing with most people, especially even as you age, your face on one side maybe starts to droop. Things change and people notice asymmetry and it makes you look unhealthy. Symmetry is something naturally as human beings, we look at other people and it actually gives us a, a peek into even before we were born, how healthy, how good is our genetic material. So, when you create that symmetry right there, you make yourself look more attractive. Now, let's talk about underwear. So, apparently almost 90% of women prefer either boxer briefs or boxers. By far, these rule. Now, you made me think, okay, 10% love tidy whities No, tidy whities were nowhere on the list. That 10%, they'd rather you just walk around naked. So, yes, but understand the ladies, yeah, they like boxers and they love boxer briefs. Now, we're in summer, so it's a little bit warm for this, but I'm still going to put the cashmere sweater on this list because, hey, summertime out on the lake gets a little bit cool. You could still pull out that sweater. Here's the reason that women love sweaters because it's all about the fabric. It's about the material that says, come touch me. A sweater is the way to go. Cashmere is just something women are drawn to and when they touch you with that sweater, guess what? They've broken the barrier. They want to get close. Next up on the list, great looking shoes. These are running shoes. Use them when you go run. Instead, have some good looking sneakers. These right here, they're casual. They're comfortable. These just ooze style. These are so much better than those running shoes. If you want to step it up, Double monk straps. Absolutely love. This is a modern classic. This is going to have you step out. You wear this with jeans, you are going to look so much better than all those other guys wearing their running shoes. Oh, double monks aren't your thing? Okay, check out these boots right here. Jodhpur style, these are going to make you look taller. Women love boots, by the way, so I can give this its own category. But I will tell you that women find boots like this incredibly sexy, incredibly attractive because it says the guy, hey, this guy who wears this, he's a rock star. He understands style. He knows what he's doing. Now, what about hats? Is this going to get you noticed? Is this going to get you compliments? In my opinion, yes, especially if you wear it with confidence. If you wear it as a functional piece that protects your head from the sun, something that you wear as part of your daily style. You're confident pulling this thing off. You know the rules. I think that this is going to set you apart from the crowd. It makes you look more mature. It's a great piece. But what you don't want to be is that guy that's just out there peacocking. He's wearing that fedora to stand out. I saw some woman writing about, she calls them the fedora douchebags. Don't be that guy. Instead, practice wearing the hat. Wear it indoors if you're not used to wearing a hat. But this right here can really set you apart. And baseball caps, I think that they can go either way. A lot of women didn't really say anything about it. Most guys are wearing a baseball cap because they simply don't want to brush their hair. But if you're wearing a lid, if you know that style and if it suits you, then go for it. But to me, it's all about an extension of your style and hats can make you look taller. So, for that reason, I put them in the list of things that you can wear to get compliments and to look better. Now, what about jeans? This was actually on a lot of women's list well-fitted jeans and that's the caveat. They have to fit your body type. They've got to work for your body because women aren't really looking at the jeans. They're looking at the way they fit your body from behind. So, if you're a slim guy, if you are a fit guy, if you're a muscular man, jeans can look great on you. Women notice. But if you're a bit overweight, if you've got more of a pear shape, if you're just a bigger, heavier dude, jeans may not be your friend. And dovetailing off that last piece, let's talk about t-shirts. Women love a well-fitted t-shirt on a man. But what does it mean to buy and find a well-fitted t-shirt? Well, guys, find out in this video right here where I break out exactly what you need to know to go out there and buy the perfect fitted t-shirt for you and your body type.